and gentlemen and welcome back we are back and ladies and gentlemen it's looking good we are currently first played 12 games 110 lost two we have conceded 13 goals and scored 34 goals with a goal difference of 21 if you just look ladies and gentlemen we are scoring a lot of goals but ladies and gentlemen we are undefeated in about six games you can see the last game we played was the Levante 2-0 defeat which I thought was quite harsh but to be fair we didn't play well we played Ferro where we beat them 3-1 then obviously we went into play in Hesca where we beat them 3-0 Azon and Lopez with the brace he's been brilliant for us for us we've changed his position slightly then we won 4-1 against Penferrada you can see a base by Karababaru he's been really good for us um, Borja Baston uh, finishes off the game um, with the fourth goal. Um, Cartagena, we beat them 3 0 at home, even as Marin and Mayano, they scored. Sporting Zion, we beat them 2 1. You can see Lopez and Thea with the game, and Ibiza, which was going to be a little bit nervous because they scored in the 29th minute, but we completely destroyed them. You can see goals from Karaburu, Lopez, Azon, Ongo, and Theo with the penalty that made sure that we were going to be good so today ladies and gentlemen we are playing Elche which are second in the league and ladies and gentlemen like we like to say let's get straight into it and let's see if this is going to be the team that we're going to play let's have a little look at the team so Ibn Az is injured so we have some options that we can do first of all let's bring some players back into the fold um, Galishki um, He's been good. Uh, Tabo, Tybo, he's been, he's been, he's been excellent for us. To be honest with you, um, yeah, he's he's been really good. We have a, quite a few injuries and stuff like that. Um, Arezzo, he's injured as well, so we're gonna see how how it's gonna look today. Um, <clears throat> Lopez has been really good, you know. Um, so to be honest with you, I think we will probably change it up. And put Lasada there to be honest with you because um, I think he's been really good for us. So, ladies and gentlemen, for today, the team we're going to have is Coke Vegas in goal. We're going to have Carboni, Carelio, Marin, and Trilli as the back four. In midfield, we have Lasada and Theo, Mayano and Lopez as the wingers, Karakaburu and Azon up front. And, ladies and gentlemen, that is the team that we are going to play today. Hopefully we'll be able to win this game as it's a very, very big game. And that would mean that we can extend our lead at the top. Fingers crossed that we'll be able to do this. But, yeah, I did say, ladies and gentlemen, I feel like this is our year. Either win the league, get automatic promotion or playoffs. So it's looking good so far. But now, ladies and gentlemen, it's about how consistent can we actually be how consistent can this team be you know and also we got to look at certain things like you know um what you call it again injuries suspensions all those things that we've got to put into consideration but ladies and gentlemen the game is on the way there we have it el Shea versus deportivo la carogna and ladies and gentlemen as again like i said it's a very big game and if we can win this game yeah it becomes unbelievable but so far they are on the attack we win the ball perfect by Lopez it's come into our box which is very dangerous I'll say but we managed to work it really really well let's go wide come on ah uh, that's very stupid um, Arente takes the shot straight into Koke's hands come on he had the player there he didn't need to miss out his partner you play it across to your next partner and we keep the ball rolling we got to look you know there's quite a lot of players on the wide positions we have to be quite careful with this and it's looking dangerous. Alex on the left-hand side. He plays it in. He's got a lot of space. And I'm not sure what happens, but we managed to clear it. It's looking quite dangerous here. We've got it's a time to be very worried. So far, it's not a good start, I must say. But let's see what happens anyway. The game is just starting. Oh, they've got a lot of players up there. So we need to be very, very careful in what we do. That is just very stupid. And luckily for us, Coke Vegas plays it. You know what? We're going to have to change something. Work ball into box, pass into space. Uh, out of possession. 
so in transition we've got to do something very quickly let's just distribute to our full backs let's see how that goes ladies and gentlemen because i don't think that's working at the moment but so far it's all them in fact we're we're doing too much here let's put that there and luckily for us it comes over nothing so far we haven't even had a shot on target ladies and gentlemen possession is mainly with lj so maybe can we you know hit hit them on the counter that's what it's looking like we may have to do they got more of the possession but we're slowly getting into the game and we've registered our first shot but not on target so let's see how it goes this is a worrying game so far but let's see what we can do man but you know these are the games that we have to try and win and it's very important that we do that you know El Shea do have a game in hand as well so it's also very important that we beat them because they are going to have a game in hand they've only played 12 games we've we've played we've played 13 obviously as we can see and it's a throw to El Shea they look the better side if I'm really honest with you um, we've managed to dispossess but they still got the ball very very crowded they take the long shot and it's gone for a goal kick it's worrying times I'm not sure realistically what to do how do we gain possession back Trillies on the ball don't do nothing silly please right let's start playing now perfect there we go Theo let's see what we can do Sebas on the ball now now it's our turn to have a touch of the ball there we go Ivan plays a long ball over to Karakaburu and that's why ladies and gentlemen he is top He looks onside to me. He's definitely onside for me. Yes, there we go. Karakaburu. That's the reason why he is top striker of the season so far. Top goal scorer. Look at that ball by Ivan Azon. Great splitting pass. Karakaburu is there. Beats the offside trap and slots it in for us. That's what we're talking about. We changed it. Small, small passes. Let's pass into space. And that's exactly what we did so far. Head on the game, boys. Head on the game. Come on. So far, so good. This is what we need. But there's still so much and they have been the better side. Without a doubt, ladies and gentlemen, they have been the better side. And I know for a fact they are going to have some opportunities. So can we make sure that they don't have any opportunities and we are very close and tight in the at the back and whatever chance we have, we're hitting them for it. Because that's the only way we're going to probably win this game. Again, Cruz hasn't been playing, I'll be honest with you. This has more or less been our, you know, starting lineup this season. And like they say, if it's not broke, don't change it. So, so far we've got 32 minutes that has played. We've got about 10 minutes plus stoppage time, obviously, till the ending of the first half. Can we just get an extra goal? That second goal is very vital. Here we have it. We've been really good set piece wise. Let's see if we can do it again. Sebas is going to step up. He's going to hook it to the near post. A lot of ricochets. There we have it, Theo. He touches it into the box, Theo. And it's just past the post. Thought that he should do a lot better. He done really well to really beat his man, get the angle. And I'm re you're really thinking and really saying to yourself, hit it. You know, he does hit it, but unfortunately he doesn't go in. But so far looking good. We're starting to gain a lot more control in the game. So far we've had seven shots, three on target xg 1.02 to 1.03 so not bad so far <clears throat> and i think just the last like what could we say the last like what 8 20 18 minutes 90 minutes i think we've slowly taken control of this game personally for me um but again anything is possible you know so let's see what's going to happen is there going to be another goal before half time or is there gonna be an equalizer and who's it gonna to be to? Who's gonna have the near who's gonna have the next goal? But like I said, ladies and gentlemen, there's something about this team that I just I just felt confident. I felt really confident that this season we were gonna do something special. Obviously it's not over yet. We've only played thirteen games so you know this can't really say much but it's it's just looking good so far. I just the team is giving, making me optimistic. You know, the team's making me feel confident about their ability and what we can actually do this season. 
Let's get straight into this. Let's get straight into this changing room. What can we do? We pump this. Things are going well, but I know you can do better. Let's see how that goes. Hopefully that can help us. We look at it, Sebas is not having the best of games. 6.5. We could realistically put Cruz there. Ah, it's really he's injured. Um and Carrillo would probably be our right back. So what we uh, what I think we're going to do is we're gonna make a slight change. Um so truly we're gonna play Alvo Carrillo and that centre back. We're gonna give Lucas Tybo an opportunity. He's been doing really good for us so far. Um, and he's a really tall lad. So it's looking good. He's actually looking good. And you know, we can also use him for set pieces as well. So let's see how that goes, ladies and gentlemen. But unfortunately, Freely's out, which means he's probably going to be out for a long time. Um, but look, we'll make it work. You know, we have Carrillo there. And I'm sure there's probably other people that we can we can probably play in that position. 51 minutes have gone so far. He gets really nervous when it's just 1-0. But the next goal is going to be extremely vital. The next highlight is going to be so vital. And like I said, ladies and gentlemen, I would happily, happily take this result as 1-0. And I'm happy. No highlight, not a problem for me. We don't get a highlight, but he's just really nervous. But you can see, ladies and gentlemen, look at the match stats. All there for you to see. We've dominated this game now. We need to finish it off. This is the problem. We need to finish off this game. But like I said, if you look at it, we start to get it back into this game. We've taken control of the game, possession-wise, and also as well, um, you know, um, XG-wise. We've had 10 corners as well. So let's really see what we can do here. Looking good so far, 65 minutes gone. And the more the time goes, the more nervous, <laughs> the more nervous I get. Um, let's do that then. The more nervous I get, I'm getting quite worried now. But we're still dominating the game, you know. And it's a really good thing we, we changed, you know, we really changed that, so. I'm really happy about that. Um, but yeah, looking good so far. Cannot complain. It looks like we're getting nearer to the 70th minute. Sorry for those that are hearing that noise. That is just a fan. It's too cold nowadays. I'm sure you all know. Um, so unfortunately, hopefully it will not. It's not overpowering. But yeah, I have to keep myself warm, I guess. So hopefully that is not annoying you guys. But here we go. 72 minutes looking like we might do some substitutions here um lopez is looking a little bit tired so let's take him off and give him a rest and you know what worse could you want but have lewis see me cruise running at you when you're really really tired you wouldn't want that would you so there you have it ladies and gentlemen there you have it uh, Sebas can have a little rest. Uh, let's put let's put Mela there. Fifteen shots, seven on target, one point eighty seven xg, fifty four percent possession, eighty nine pass completion, sixteen corners. Okay, Ivan has the ball, plays it out wide to Mela. He is left footed, but he skipped past his player. He plays it back into Carrillo, back to Lasada. Lasada is going to play it back to Carboni. You've got to be very careful here. Do not lose this ball. Right, Carboni on that left-hand side. Can he whip that ball in? Uh, he's come back on himself. Back to Lasada. Plays it back to Carbello. He crosses the ball in. Ivan's going to have an opportunity. And he's just past the post. It's a lovely save by the keeper. How he managed to do that, I don't know. Right, let's, uh, let's go for Tabo. Tabo is a tall lad. Let's aim for him. Come on. Lewis C.B. Cruz steps up. 81 minutes. Can we score this? Crosses the ball in. Lower ricochet. Uh, let's go. You got to take him down. Take him down. Take him out. Let's go. Take him out. Come on, boys. 
Oh, well done. That's done. That's done. Oh, Ivan's tired. He's, uh, no more sub left. Done. Ah. No. I got. F no. Don't do this to me, please. Elche with the corner. Gets headed. A lot of ricochets going on. I'm not sure what's going on. He's still going on. Ah, friggin' hell, man. Shit. Ah. They didn't deserve this, man. Friggin' hell. How we did not get rid of that. Right, let's go attacking. I saw it coming, man. Darn. Darn, darn, darn. Didn't clear the ball. Obviate those two points of where they could be. Now, I'm not sure. I think I <clears throat> there wasn't really in much click out chances. Both teams had one click out chance. <sighs> Got it though, man. Got it. And yeah, it looks like it's going to be a draw. There we have it. Full time here. Away from home, I guess that's a good point, but I feel a bit, you know. Let's just say they're unlucky, man. Like, they are unlucky, but, you know, we should have really created more with the, with, with the stats, match stats that we have. But, look, it is what it is. So it goes. There we have it, Lesbian. Let's see how Freely's out for one to two days. That's not bad. That's okay. Let's have a look at the schedule. Let's play a few offline. Maybe we come back for Granada or Lugo. One of those two we can come back for. But, ladies and gentlemen, that's all for today. We're still undefeated in seven games. It's dropped. So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for watching. I am Fort Manager Maniac. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share. Hit the thumbs up and notification bell. Well. Ladies and gentlemen, if you are new, Hit the, hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you're new but ladies and gentlemen that's all for today thank you very much for watching and i'll see you all next time hit the comments below let me know what you think about the game and our chances of winning the league ladies and gentlemen thank you again see you next time